assumptions that need to be fulfilled before performing principal component analysis abbreviated as PCA for data extracted from questionnaire or survey based on Likert scale. PCA is multivariate statistical method that is performed to reduce the number of items uh, into a smaller um, number called principal components. Before performing the statistical method, certain assumptions have to be uh, fulfilled so what are the assumptions that have to be fulfilled before performing PCA? The first assumption is that multiple variables are measured at a continuous level or ordinal. So the data or the responses uh, collected from participant uh, uh, completing the questionnaire it can be an ordinal based on five Likert scale from one to five or seven or nine and so on. Or the responses can be a continuous uh, variable. So there should be a linear relationship between all variables if they are continuous. B, C, A is based on Pearson correlation coefficient. The method also can be used for ordinal data such as Likert scale. Linearity can be tested using a matrix scatter plot. The second assumption is sampling adequacy. There have to be enough number of participants. There have to be five to ten participant per question or per items as a minimum sample size. Using rule of thumb, ten participant per question can be considered. And the way to check or the method to check where, whether there is a sampling adequacy is to uh, perform a Kaiser, Meyer, Oakland sampling adequacy uh, that will measure uh, the sampling adequacy for all um, over all data sets. The third assumption is that the data should be suitable for data reduction, sufficient correlation between variables to reduce variable to a smaller set of components, though there should be a correlation between items uh, that correlation has to be within a certain uh, values uh, from 0.3 to 0.8. The uh, parlet test of sericity can be performed to test uh, this uh, assumption. The fourth assumption is that there is no significant outliers. And the fifth assumption is is independent variable are correlated to each other. The another assumption is that principal component are assumed to be independent of each other. And finally, there should be a homoscasticity in which the variance of the data is constant across all level of the independent variables. If you find this video useful, do subscribe to the channel, leave any comment in the indicated uh, box and activate the notification bell to receive the recent and uh, latest release uh, into the channel of several different video clips and click on the like icon and share the video link with others so the channel can expand and improve to include a large scope of different statistical method and how to analyze data using uh, several different uh, statistical packages such as SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R-Statistic, 
or statistics graph pad prism g power python and rev man if you are a student or a researcher and you have a data whether it is um, um, quantitative all qualitative and you want to perform a statistical uh, analysis on that data using any of the softwares listed here whether it's SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, Revman, GMP, Python then do contact me to arrange for either a one-to-one -one private tutor session or a training course uh, on any of these uh, statistical packages my contact details are given here so don't hesitate to uh, write to me or email me if you need uh, a private one-to-one uh, -one, uh, tutoring or a training course